How y'all doing there, Hilljack Nation? Welcome to my truck again. Uh, had a slight change of plans, though. I was headed to Kentucky for an afternoon hunt. I think I told y'all that last week on last week's video. But uh, as I was driving out of my subdivision to the corner to get some gas, my brother-in-law called and said he wasn't feeling good. My brother-in-law, Rick, in Kentucky. So, uh, hey, here in Hilljack Nation, we learned to adjust on the fly. So I got back in the truck and I headed east to the Indiana farm. My brother-in-law, Will, is up there hunting. He hunted this morning. I stayed home and did some laundry and stuff this morning because it was raining and I didn't feel like getting out in the rain. But uh, anyway, yeah, I'm back in Indiana instead of Kentucky. So y'all stay tuned and hopefully you get to see some good deer action from the Perry County Farm. What up, Bill Jack Nation? Headed to the stand. Beautiful, beautiful fall morning. All afternoon, sorry. Me and my brother in law are headed to a couple of stands in his electric buggy. Just to give you a little view there of what we're driving for. Hopefully, we'll get into some deer. This afternoon. tucked in down there in a little chair blind hoping to catch him coming out by that persimmon tree so anyway just a beautiful fall day a little sprinkly hoping to run into some deer y'all stay tuned well we've got a fawn over there in the field mom stepped up for a second and then went back in the woods but the fawn is still in there looking around just have to see if mom's gonna come out or not. But uh, the baby's standing there under them yellow leaves there. Not. All right, so mom has finally stepped out of the woods. She's over there now, about 50 yards away. No way for me to shoot her right now. She's gonna walk up that tree line with the baby, I guess. The baby's over there on the tree line. Just hugging that tree line. They're not coming out here in the field. I got a clover food plot right in front of me. And they are just absolutely hugging that tree line over there. But that's alright. I'm really after a boyfriend anyway. I need him to step out. But nothing has come out down by Will. But, uh, as far as nothing's come out where I could shoot it up here. See worth a damn in there. It's getting dark. It's already past sunset. They're over there eating either autumn olives or honeysuckle or something. Mom that just keeps watching the stand in the field and eating along behind her baby. Pretty cool baby. Alright, we didn't have uh, any luck last night so we're getting ready to go out this morning. Got the uh, golf cart all loaded down, electric golf cart to help us be quiet <laughs> when we go. That's Will's crossbow. My crossbow in the front of there. Anyway, we're just uh, just waiting to waiting on Will 
to head out. That's uh, it's a little early. It's like 5:45. I don't think shooting lights to like 6:30 or so. So we're doing all right on that. <laughs> Good morning, Hilljack Nation. Happy Halloween. It's uh, dark. I'm in my stand nice and early. But since it was Halloween, I figured I'd do this little flashlight in the dark thing we all used to do as kids when we told scary stories. Anyway, I'm down here in Fern Valley hunting my favorite stand since I sort of made this food plot. And uh, anyway... Got my crossbow hanging above me over here. I got my backpack over here. I'm hanging on a tree and I'm just kind of hanging out in a tree also. Waiting. Well, the, the sun is making its way up and it is absolutely beautiful down in here. The trees are all turning yellow. It's just light enough to see it real good. The sun's not peeking up behind the clouds yet. Anyway, y'all check out this view. Well, so if you stuck around to this part of the video, you probably figured out we ain't shot a deer uh we did see i saw a mom and a fawn yesterday afternoon will saw that same mom and fawn yesterday morning uh but uh just you know not quite they're just not quite there yet i think they're getting close i think we're very close to you know the time when uh we're gonna have a lot of daylight activity Next weekend is the first full weekend in November, or the first weekend in November. That's usually a good time to be hunting. So uh, anyway, I went around and I got all the all the scrapes refreshed and got my camera and cars changed and you know get the uh, times all set on my camera so we're ready for when the time changes next weekend. And just uh, you know, trying to make it where we can be successful in the woods but uh anyway that's gonna wrap up this video i'm headed to the house and uh you all just please stay safe out there and we're gonna see you next time